started? I think we've started. That's weird, because on the, um, the computer, I have a countdown. On this, I do not. This is my phone. And I can actually record for as long as I want today, guys. So, I'm sorry if my voice sounds different, and if my phone picks up more background noises than my computer does. So obviously I don't have a mic for my phone. It's just my phone. And yeah, that's about it. Okay, so welcome to Pokemon Shuffle. It's another game I have played before, but it's on my DS and not on my phone. And of course I can't record my DS because I don't have like a capture card in for it. And if I get a capture card for anything, I want to get a capture card for the Switch. So, enough of that. Let's just get right into Pokemon Shuffle. And you guys can watch how terrible I am at... Um, puzzle games. Yeah, those awful at them. Okay, we're gonna go through the terms. I also can't, well, I can't pause as easily. Just please do not use your actual name. I'm not, I'm not. There we go. Okay. Why, well, hello, you must be the new trainer. You're about to start out on a journey to meet Pokemon. I'm a media. I'm here to cover all your progress and report it. Get used to seeing this face. Now, where are we off to first? Ah, oh, I spy a wild Esper over there. Let's check it out. It's finally time for your first battle, huh? Pretty exciting. Yep. Oh, and one more thing. Do you see these hearts here? Every time you start a battle, you use up one heart. This timer shows how long before you regenerate a heart. Okay. So we can get right into this. Ah, oh, there it is, what Esper. Okay, line up Pokemon in the puzzle area to attack and reduce your opponent's HP to zero in order to win. Yes. So we can drag them wherever we want, which is great. Yep, both combo, energy, cool. There's that giant combo right there. Nice. You did it, your opponent is weak out of HP. Boop. And then we could try to catch it. So, this is your chance to catch it. This will make a great story. Okay, and we just have the major ball, and hope that stays in. Well, it's going to stay in because it's max. Beautiful, it's going to make a great report thanks to you. You reached S rank on your first ever battle, that's great. When you defeat a Pokemon, you can get coins too. You've got some skill, you're racking up rewards already. I'm pretty sure that, like, everyone does in the beginning. Okay, and then there's a Bulbasaur. Now we have this Esper, so we can put it on our team. And continue on. Yes, time to get started. Yes, we have coins. Okay, let's continue. Okay. So I'm gonna move... Okay, yes, I can do that, but also... No, I don't want to move the high penny. I mean, I can. It's just fine. Okay, actually, that was, like, real easy. Look at that. Boom, that blue controller is down. And tap. Okay, we caught it. It wasn't very difficult either. But now I have a Bulbasaur. Great. Moving on. Bulby Squirtle. Okay, and we should optimize. Yes. Great, continue. Okay. Let's move. Here, so that way you can move this guy here. 
and boom. Done. Okay, he should stay in. I mean, the chances of him staying in are pretty good. Yeah. If only catching starters is that easy. Okay, and there's Charmander. We're just gonna pay until we run out of hearts. I think that sounds about right. I mean, I don't. Okay, never mind. I do see how it hurts to have sore. Just because of how this is set up. Okay. Let's move this expert to here. Boom. We destroyed that Charmander. Great, we caught the Charmander. Now we can continue on. Yes, now Eevee, optimize. I kind of want Charmander to be in the Because I like Charmander, but it's only those four. And Charmander actually is my favorite starter, but he was not my first starter. If that makes sense. Okay, now let's see what I want to do. There's like no time limit, so I could do whatever I want. I'm going to move this ice cream and put it right there. Boom. And really I didn't have to think. Since. Uh, that Eevee was almost out of health anyway. Okay, chances are we're not going to catch it. And that's okay, because then we can just try again. If we have to. Yeah, okay. Okay, she wants us to use a great ball instead. That's fine. If she wants to give us a great ball, she can give us a great ball. It'll work just fine. And there we go. There's that Eevee. Now moving on. Moving on, moving on. Okay. Here, there's a jewel. Okay, she wants us to spend that jewel on more hearts. Uh, of course. Because it's the tutorial. And that's okay, because then we can just continue on. And out. Optimize. Okay, it wants us to put Esper in the front. Which is fine with me. Okay, so that Esper turned into a wood block. That's okay. Because so we could just destroy it like that. And then we can move this Eevee and boom, put it right there. And then move this Eevee and put it right in the middle. Okay, so now that Pidgey is out. And tap. One, two, and three. There's a Pidgey. So I can go a little bit farther. Yep, we caught a Pidgey. So now on to Togepi. Yeah, okay. I should probably just like start clicking Optimize once and just leave it. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do from here on. Because otherwise I spend too long optimizing, hoping that, like, my favorite Pokemon are in the team. And I don't think that's entirely necessary. I just do it. Okay. Okay, we did great. So we can catch this Togepi. Can you imagine it breaks out with a 2% chance? Okay, well, I didn't, so it's all good. Okay, moving on, moving on. Two Pichu. Okay. 
So I clicked it. I clicked it once. So I'm not wasting time deciding like all oh, my Pokemon again. Okay, we can move this right here. I just didn't run out of way. And then this portal here. Okay. And then this EV right here. Victory. Okay, great. And tap. Come on, Pichu. No. You go butt? No. I'll just try again. I'm not wasting a great ball on you. Like, I'm seriously not. It's not happening. Okay. That's not what I want to do. I want to do this. And... I'm going to put you... Not there. I could swap that and get both of those. Actually, that was a great move. Much better move than I thought it was going to be. Okay, now we have another chance at catching that Pichu. And tap. One, two, three. Oh my gosh. No. This Pichu is being a little rascal. I will catch it though, I'm not just gonna leave it. Yeah, I will catch the Pichu. Because I don't want to leave any Pokemon uncaught. Okay. No, no, okay, I see what you want me to do, but what do I want to do? Do that. And then move you right here. Boom. And just want to try again of catching this Pichu. Come on. Nice. see how far we can continue. I don't think we have like any hearts left. Okay, we have one heart left. So we can take on this Audino and then finish off here. Okay, so you're gonna do that. Um, do this. And then move this here. That was a pretty good move, I think. I never know if it's a good move. I'm not good at puzzle games, and I'm too impatient to like, look at everything I possibly could do. Be like, what's the best thing I could ever do? I see things are looking and I go with it. Okay. So can we catch you, Audino? I don't know if I can catch you. <laughs> I'm so funny. Okay, there we go, we have an odd now. And everyone's doubling up, everything's great. Okay, caught odd now. Okay, thanks for you. Yeah, it's a mega odd now. Wow. Okay. Well, I don't actually have any... ...thing to, um... Like, I don't have a Mega Stone. I mean, not a Mega Stone, a heart. I don't have a Mega Stone either, but I don't have hearts. So anyway, we're going to end this episode here, and we could take on Ondo if we decide to continue this. So, I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye!